Steve Biko Academic Hospital under the spotlight. A member of the public reportedly showed the video at the hospital showing the nurses going about their private business while the patient, who is believed to have had an acute chronic illness, was groaning in pain. The patient, who later died, was sitting on the floor waiting for a doctor to attend to him. The five nurses in the video have since been suspended. The unfortunate incident happens at a time when Steve Biko Hospital is strengthening interventions to improve patients' experience of care. Those measures include the launch of the Gauteng Department of Health I Serve with a Smile campaign, which is a change management program aimed at improving staff attitude and quality of service. In addition, the hospital management has been conducting frequent walkabouts across various departments within the hospital to assess the levels of, of service delivery and to interact with patients. An anonymous patient who was recently admitted to the same hospital for burn wounds has also related his harrowing experience with some nurses. I got negative discharge, I got self-discharge. I ended up discharging myself and I'm not yet healed. I could not remain at the hospital because of these nurses. They are impatient and shout at us instead of taking care of us. They only spend time talking to one another just to wind down the clock so that they can knock off. But while concerned about the condition of his hand, he has vowed not to go back to hospital again. The Democratic Nursing Association of South Africa has vehemently defended nursing staff. We want to also call against the trend that we have observed uh, from the society or the members of the community of ill-treating the nurses at their line of duty. And we further want to call against the government or the department on how they conduct themselves when these issues they come to light or when they are spread or trending on social media platforms simply because of they don't get to mention the systematic failures that compromises these nurses at their working stations. Banda says among others, the chronic staff shortage that's stifling the country's health system has never been addressed. Meanwhile, the provincial department says the patient has already been laid to rest However, his family is not yet ready to comment about the ordeal. Mulemo Onemotwa, SABC News, Pretoria.